Hi everyone, Dom Designs here, back with a new tutorial. Today, I will teach you how to draw Marshmallow as a flat design in Adobe Illustrator. I've been binge listening to Marshmallow all week and thought to myself, why not draw him? So this illustration was based on two images I found on Google. The first being the helmet itself and then his body with the helmet tilted to the right a little. So let's begin by drawing the helmet. Firstly, let's create a layer and name it Outline. Then we will select the helmet layer and turn it into a template. Let's select the black stroke with a 10 points thickness and make sure to round off the caps in the corners. Select the ellipse tool and draw and align the ovals at the top and at the bottom of the helmet. With the direct selection tool, I'll delete the top middle anchor points of the bottom oval. Then with the pen tool, I'll connect the ovals like so. Now let's make two closed shapes by selecting all and bringing up the shape builder tool. I'll click on the front of the helmet and this will separate the unnecessary shape at the top, which we will delete. For the mouth, I'll be using the pen tool and draw out only the left side. Then using the Reflect tool, I'll reflect it to the right. And then going to the Pathfinder, we will merge both shapes together. Then I'll move on to the eyes by using the Pen tool as well. Great, now that the head is completed, I have adjusted it to the body using the reference image. I'll then draw out the outline of the body using the combination of shapes and the pen tool. For the color, I'll select the oval and go to the top menu and select Object, Path, Offset Path. This will create an oval going around the original one. Using the Pen tool and the Direct Selection tool, I'll delete the anchor points to create gaps. Alright, so for the finishing touches of the outline, I'll bring up the Width tool. By clicking and dragging on the strokes, I'll vary the thicknesses of my lines in order to make the illustration more interesting to look at. Awesome! We're now done with the outline process, so now let's add our base color. I'll create a new layer and name it Color and place it below the outline layer. I'll then select the head, go back to the layer panel. While holding down Option on my keyboard, I'll drag the little green square down to the color layer. 
By doing so, I have made a copy of the head directly below to the color layer. This will allow us to color the artwork without affecting our outline. Now we can select our shapes and remove the fill and apply the base colors. I will now be adding some shadows and highlights. I'll select the top of the helmet and do a copy and paste in place twice in order to create three layers of color. I'll then move over the top layer to create a gap. Then I'll bring up the shape builder tool to delete the excess shapes. Now let's give the shape inside a gray color for the shadow. I'll then repeat this process for the remainder of the helmet. Following the same steps, I'll give the neck and the shirt its base color, and then I'll be adding the shadows and highlights with a combination of the pen tool and the shape builder tool. For this highlight, I created a stroke which I thickened using the width tool. I then turned the stroke into a shape by going to the object menu, path, outline stroke. Now I'll add some cool looking lines going around my character. So for this, I'll select for example the helmet and go to Object, Menu, Offset Path, and then play with the units. I'll then delete parts of the lines and vary the thicknesses of the strokes using the Width tool once more. I'll do this throughout my whole illustration.
And there you have it. This is how I draw the DJ Marshmallow as a flat design illustration in Adobe Illustrator. As always, I hope you enjoyed this video and please let me know what you think in the comments below. Cheers everyone!